So I'm here to give that information to you. Yo! The fuck? As I was saying before I was rudely interrupted, in this video, we're gonna give you a brief rundown of what intermittent fasting is, give you the ratios that people use. We're going to touch on my 30 day results, how I went from this Bruh. to this. Put your drinks up! And at the end of the video, if you stick around, you'll get some bonus tips on how to speed up fat loss and how to avoid the pitfalls of screwing up your fast. Let's get into the video. What is intermittent fasting? Intermittent fasting in a nutshell is abstaining from food from a certain amount of time and then allowing yourself another specific amount of time, which is a lot smaller, to grub. Me excite! So let's take the ratios. Initially, when people start off with intermittent fasting, they start off with a 16-hour fasting window and an 8-hour feeding window. You can bump up to 18 and 6, 20 and 4, and you can go all the way up to 36. But during the time that you fast, you do not consume anything that will spike your insulin. It's good to drink water, it's good to drink black coffee, and green tea with no sugar. You don't wanna to try to cheat this process because it could bite you in the ass. Okay. So when I started, I started with 20, what was it? 20 hours of fasting and four hours of feeding. So let's get into my 30 day results really quick. I lost about 12 pounds in the 30 days. I was going for 10 pounds a month. I figured that my weight goal is gonna be like a three to four month thing and then I'm gonna be flexible with my intermittent fasting. My body fat dropped down from 19% to 17%, which is great. My water, levels stayed around 58%, which is pretty high. Because you have to understand that when you start fasting, if you cut out carbs, you're gonna cut out a lot of the water you get from those carbohydrates. Thus, when you eat carbs, you get nice and bloated, like breads, beers, cakes. So you wanna kinda stay away from carbs. You don't wanna cut them out completely, but try not to have any processed foods and things like that. You can get your carbs from veggies. I know you don't wanna hear anything about veggies, but veggies are good. So here are some before and after pictures, and take it into account that I haven't done any weight lifting during this whole entire time. Now I'm gonna start introducing the weight lifting with the fasting and the slight cardio that I do. So all in all, I think intermittent fasting is a great method for me. It might work for you. I really like intermittent fasting because it teaches the body to use fat for fuel. So hopefully it can work for you. All right, so now let's get to those bonus tips. So it's very important that you stay hydrated. All right, you wanna drink tons of water but make sure that water is some kind of filtered water or water that has electrolytes. If you can't get your electrolytes, you can supplement them with this product. So this is a product by a company called Key Nutrients, and it's an electrolyte powder. It's sugar-free and sweetened by stevia, which is a natural root, and it won't spike your insulin. It gives our body the six key nutrients and electrolytes that we need magnesium, potassium, calcium, and more. So if you want to pick this up, I'll leave a link in the description. Next, I want you to add apple cider vinegar to your water. You've heard a lot of things about apple cider vinegar. I'll link the benefits in an article in the description below, but it really helps you bump up your fat burning and there's enzymes in it that help with gut health. Last bonus tip, I want you to avoid any kind of zero calorie drinks. Like LaCroix is good because it has zero calories, zero sodium. There's no flavor to it. But those drinks like um, Powerade Zero, Diet Coke, Coke Zero, things like that, those have artificial sweetness in it and those are gonna stimulate your insulin response and break your fast. Eliminate those. 
So I hope you enjoyed this video. I would appreciate the thumbs up. Please subscribe to the channel and we're going to put out videos every week to help you become your best athletic self. So this is Sean Green signing off. Peace and love.